And tonight, a man is in custody accused of shooting three people and killing one inside a barber shop on Indy's east side. That shooting happened just over a year ago. Our John Duran spoke with police and a barber who heard the gunfire about this lengthy investigation. I'm just so relieved now. I'm so relieved. It's, it's, it's been a long time coming. Philip Howard cuts hair at Champs Barbershop on 10th Street and he was working September 30th last year. It was my smoke break time, so I'm going outside to smoke my break, to smoke on my break, as soon as I'm about to smoke, pow, 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 pow. We like, what's going on? I run to the back of the building, come in through the back, people running out the back and everything, it happened so fast. Three people were shot. One man, Kevin Stigger, was killed. Anytime you, something like this happens when you're just literally trying to get a haircut, um, the community has been on edge for the better part of a year while we were investigating this. Uh, I can say that uh, the streets are a heck of a lot safer now that this individual is off the streets. Police reports show us that suspect was taken into custody Friday morning at this strip mall behind me, less than two blocks away from Champs Barbershop. We can just push forward now, man. I can tell everybody that he got caught and um, that justice is served. Police say although it took a year to make an arrest, detectives never stopped their investigation. I believe that this case just proves that sometimes these cases can go on a, a while. Sometimes our detectives, um, they may have really good information, but we need to prove it. The suspect is preliminarily charged with reckless homicide, attempted murder, and criminal recklessness. In Indianapolis, John Duran, 13 News.